Hey, what's up? We are live, and we're going to do a live cop via sneakers. I'm only going to go for this shoe on sneakers because I don't think the foot sites are going to have a lot of big sizes. Now, this shoe comes in woman's sizing, um, but if you go up one and a half sizes for the men's, then you can get it in your size if your uh, if your foot is big like mine all right so there there is some news on the nike sneakers app so let's uh look at oh they, they added some models all right so I'm going for this today. Um, I'm going to go for it in a woman's 12.5 because it's uh, a men's size 11 shoe. So that's going to be the size I order in. I, I like this shoe a lot. Now, um, they recently did a, a, a military black, you know, Air Jordan 4 that I skipped. They they did it. They, they did a restock, and there weren't a lot of pairs available. But I, I didn't take uh, the bait because I'm going for you know. The, I have bigger prospects than the you know, Jordan Reserve. They did you know? Here's a nice looking dunk. I, I noticed that the price is at 160 for dunks. That's crazy. Um, I, I mean, I, I'm going to keep the dunks I have now. I'm not going to go for dunks unless they are a collab. Or, all right, so this is the Midnight Navy 4. Um, this looks good. My phone isn't, my computer isn't charging. All right, so. All right, yeah, so. All right, so <laughs> now we're in charging mode. Hey, right, th this looks good. Um, it's it seems like a lot of other fours that came out before. I I'm not as enthused about it as I am about the one I'm going for um, during this live cop. Uh, th this one I like a lot. This Detroit themed too low. I'm definitely going for this. I mean, th this looks really good. Uh, the problem is the translucent bottom. I mean, it'll get dirty fast, but I, I really want this to be my Air Jordan 2 <laughs> because I, I like that a lot. I mean, look at that nice colorway. It looks great. Let's see what else there is. Here's another Air Jordan 2. Oh, wow, they're doing two different Air Jordan 2s. Oh, oh, okay, so let's look at this Air Jordan 2. Uh, I'm not enthused about this one. I'm, I'm definitely not going to go for it. I'm, I'm only going for the Detroit one. This, to me, is not something that i need shall we say uh, well let's look at the woman's edition uh yeah the, the woman's edition looks better than the men's it has more elements but i, I still I, I i'm not going to try to get that um what else is on the horizon yeah oh uh, this this looks good uh, the Dunk Day of the Dead. The you know, funny thing is, I might try to go for this. This Dunk looks really good. I mean, it's not an SB Dunk, but I, I like this. I mean, I, I don't know what I'd wear it with. There's an Air Force One. Okay, so let's look at this 
Skate Like a Girl SB. SB dunks are not in style now. Um, well, let me check resale on this. What's the SB dunk skate like a girl? What does it resell for? 224. Uh, yeah, there's not a lot. I, I think I'm going to not go for this just because there's minimal resale and it's kind of boring to me. Well, not, not that it's boring, it's that, you know, SBs are just not as hyped up as they used to be, I'm afraid. And I think that market is finished. Oh, this looks good. Florida a and M. I mean, the, the, this, I like this. FAMU. That's not bad. We brag differently. Oh, that's cool. Uh, so, I mean, that's one I would consider. Now they say Nike is going to do something about resellers. Uh, they're going to make it so... I, I think basically what they're going to do is make it so I cannot order like as many pairs of these, you know, as I could in the past. I mean, I think the type of reseller that they're targeting is someone who would order hundreds of these uh, shoes and try to sell them for like a $5 profit. And then these resellers would return all of their inventory. Um, I mean, it's good that they're doing that. I mean, we, we don't need, you know, people driving up the cost of shoes for, you know, people, the, the common folk. Yeah, I, I don't resell my shoes. Um, yeah, so, I mean, they're going to limit as to how many of, you know, their shoes that don't sell out immediately like these you could possibly get. And they might even not let you buy it if, like, you hit a lot. And, you know, so they're, they're going to, I mean, it, it shouldn't impact, like, the people who view this channel or me at, at all. Uh, well, let's look at Vakeda Tan. I like this. I mean, I'm not going to go for it, but it looks great. That, that's not bad at all. Uh, but as I say, the best one, you know, on my horizon it, over the next few days, it's going to be this uh, Detroit themed too. I, I like that for some reason. When is that? Uh, Twenty one. All right, so it's it, it's next week. Yeah, you'll you'll have. You'll have an opportunity next week. Let's see what's on kicks on fire. Is there anything? No. Let's look on Sneaker Bar in Detroit. Uh, here, here's some news. Uh, this is the cool gray Air Jordan 6. Oh, this is interesting. Yeah, I think I'll be going for this in February. This isn't bad at all. I, I like this one a lot, actually. Mm -hmm. um, Nigel Sylvester uh, is Black Air Jordan 1. Yeah, this looks good. I, I mean, I don't know how available it's going to be. It looks like one of those hyper-exclusive ones that's going to be impossible to get your hands on, but... 
I mean, th this looks good for me. I mean, I'm not sure who Nigel Sylvester even is, but I like it. Um, the Street Fighter, Street Fighter versus Reebok. That's interesting. I mean, I've never had these pump shoes. I, I wouldn't know what they're all about. I mean, I mean I, maybe I should get them someday, but to me, <laughs> Reebok, you know, I, I, I don't know about their brand. I know Adidas sold them for a huge loss. <laughs> um, I mean, some people love their shoes. I think they have a cult following. I hope they come back. I mean, I just don't know how much I want those pumps because they seem useless. Oh, I like this pawn shop SB Dunk High. This looks good for a black shoe. Oh, oh I like how they put those uh, wings on uh, the check. I mean, that's really interesting. Hey, yeah, I, I'll go for this pawn shop. Old soul. But hey, th this looks really good. Yeah, I, I'm going to pick me up a pair of these. <laughs> They're interesting. All right, so what else is there? Uh, Yeezy, I mean, I, I'm not sure if I'm ever even going to get a pair of Yeezys again. You know, after all Kanye has done, I mean, I, I'm not even, I, I shouldn't even, you know, venture into that territory. <laughs> He's so controversial, you know, uh, I mean, he, I, I mean, I'm disappointed in him. I mean, he's got to apologize. But this Puma looks good. And and I think Yeezys are declining in price anyway. So, I mean, if you're a speculator, understand that it's getting easier and easier and easier to cop Yeezys. But this uh, Puma, get this, maybe Puma could replace Yeezy as uh, the one everyone goes for. Oh, th this looks interesting. The 37 Rui. Oh, I, I like these colors. Oh, they these are interesting. Oh, I, I, oh, I want to get a pair 37. Yeah, 37 Jordans look good. To craft the, this, I could do without. I'm basically not interested in this at all. It's okay, <laughs> but yeah, as I say, we are waiting until that sneakers drawing. I mean, I'm just curious as to what my results are going to be because I have hit recently. Uh, I got some Jordans and I've already hit on a pair of Air Jordan 4s and they're very difficult to hit on. So I wouldn't want to. Yeah, I think that they might block me from winning the big size because every a lot of guys are going to be going for them. Uh, let's see what. Lost and found Air Jordan ones yeah the, these are going to be the shoe to get in november i i got you should get two pairs of these i mean these look really good i like these shoes a lot All right, so yeah, we are live copping. Yeah, I started a little bit early. I want to practice going 
I want to practice starting the streams earlier. Hopefully I'll get some more subscribers. If you're new to this channel, please feel free to subscribe. We are looking at shoes and talking, you know, about you know, stuff within the sneaker culture. That that that's what I do a lot of on this channel. Uh so hopefully we're gonna hit a thousand subscribers uh soon. Uh we're at 260 now. Oh, that's not bad. 260 subscribers so uh yeah hopefully we're gonna explode to a thousand uh yeah you could subscribe on all your accounts <laughs> well look at this man that that looks good Uh, well, what, what is this kicks on fire i mean there all right so let's see no no the november marnier fours this is what they look like obviously a lot of people are going to want them and they're going to be tough to get um Yeah, this Air Jordan 2 is going to be tough to get. Um, oh Let's just look at Z sneaker heads. Um, I think this cool gray uh, six is like probably like the best. Looks really good. I like this woman's shoe. That's that's nice, isn't it? I just don't know if it's releasing in men's sizing. Sometimes they don't release the shoes in men's sizing. Uh, for June 24th, this red six looks really good. Uh, Um, you know, th this looks good also, this black six. I wouldn't mind that. Um, yeah, I'm just looking around at stuff now. Uh, this one is coming back. This is going to be tough to get. I, I like this shoe also. But I like my red crimson more. Um, yeah, the, this is for women. This Air Jordan Five looks good. All in all, it looks like there's plenty of good shoes to get. Uh, yeah, but I, I mean, that being said, I think the sneaker culture is declining. Uh, to me, it seems like there's too many shoes on the market. All right, so let's look at what we're going for today. Here, here are nice pictures of it. I mean, these pictures do it justice. I, I think this is a very nice colorway. Now, my favorite thing about this shoe is the colorway. That Joker themed for aesthetic. That, that looks really good. Uh, yep, so we are waiting until the bewitching hour 
10 o'clock. Um, oh, there's these. UNC fives. A lot of people are going to like these. I happen to like these. Uh, I mean, I'm not going to go for them um, just because I already have two pairs of fives. But the, this colorway looks good. Uh, and let's see. I mean, all, all in all, oh, okay, so this is going to be the big, I think I might pay resale for this, the Trophy Room 7. I, I love this shoe. <laughs> Man, I, I want this a lot. Um, and I think I'm going to get it through whatever means necessary. But let's look on StockX. Uh, let's look at airship prices. Uh, oh, so size 11 i think i might buy this one today if i don't succeed at getting the fours just because i think this shoe is going to be really hot um i the airship is not one that i i have uh, so I, i'm gonna want to review this on the channel now this is a plain two color weighed shoe just two color shoe but it looks Good. Uh, I'm into it. All right. It's 15 minutes until the four releases. Uh, let's look at Air Jordan 4 prices. Let's see. So this is the one I got. You know, since what's well, 381. I mean, this this is the has the most resale recently out of the fours and you know i think i like this colorway more now, that's the funny thing is as yeah, remember i gotta get all right so 353 i mean I'm, I'm up against the big odds tonight today on sneakers so you know a, a lot of things have to go right for me to win but all of, I, I could say I like this shoe a lot. It looks really good. <laughs> and if I get it, I well, I'll have to try it on because I'm going to want to see how women's fours fit. But man, this colorway. I just like the, you know, I, I like the furry aspect of it. It has like a lot of fur on it. <laughs> I think I might even sell the pair I have just to keep these if I get it because I like these more. That's the funny thing, man. That perfect Joker shoe. I'd, I'd wear this. I'd wear this shoe every time I watched Batman. All right, guys, if you're new, please feel free to subscribe. We're, we're, we're trying to get a million subs. Uh, yeah. So look at this. Um, it looks good. Hey, and you might want to, if you get this shoe, you might want to pick it up at FedEx because drivers are stealing shoes. And, you know, if someone, if the driver, if someone at FedEx steals your shoes, then I, I mean, I think they'd have to give you a refund if they saw you open a box and it was empty. Uh, you know, that, that might co trigger them to do a, like a, uh, report. Oh, let's look at Zen Master Fours. Well, what does this go for? Oh, 249. This looks good. I, I, I didn't know that the Zen Master Fours were available for so cheap. Oh, wow. Only 250 for this? This looks really good. You know, I think I like this colorway the best, man. If, if I got, if I hit today, I think I might trade in for this because you hardly ever see this. Look at all of these, the translucent paneling and that, uh, how it lights up. <laughs> well, I mean, maybe I have some trading to do. <laughs> I, I do like the Zen Master 4 <laughs> a lot. All right, let's... Uh... 
fire red fours. These are good. You can't go wrong with these. 400. Yeah, they, they ain't bad. I mean, they're better than my colorway. I mean, there are, there are lots of colorways of these fours that I like more than mine. And I'm not much into black canvas, military black, and infrared. The infrared in that, I, there's another infrared Jordan that I like the four, uh, out of the fours. Oh, I like Topaz. Topaz is a good one. Uh, the PSG looks good. I regret not going for that. But where, I thought there was another infrared four that came out last year. But I, I oh, oh yeah, th this is another infrared four. I, I like this version of the infrared four more so than that other one they made. I think that's a lot nicer. Um, what the cool grays look like. Uh, cool grays are just plain, but they look good. All right, yeah, we're 10 minutes until the drawing now. Uh, Otoro Bravo looks really good. Uh, look at that. Uh, 700 bucks if Otoro Bravo. Wow. Uh, okay, so yeah, we, we are just lounging around waiting for the drawing of the day which is this halloween themed air jordan 4. the drawing is in 10 minutes on sneakers it's on other websites like Foot Locker, but i'm not even going to waste my time sitting in their waiting rooms because i think that the odds of me hitting there are very low and i don't want to waste you know, precious time on nothing so well not that time is so precious but i mean why you know spend time waiting in line when you're just going to lose uh let's look at other airships here's the Menmarnier airship that i went for it's, it's very limited 618 dollars yeah Oh, I, I mean, that looks good, though. I wish I had that. Uh, but he, here's the best one you could get, I think. Oh, 476 for this. Uh, I would spend, I mean, the price on this is going down. But this is like one of the best Jordans you could, Jordan sneakers available because it's so rare. All right, we are one minute, 10 minutes until the drawing. Uh, all right, so yeah, we are 10 minutes until the draw, until the drawing occurs. Gotta get some water, I'll be right back.
All right, so we are now five minutes until the buying frenzy ensues. We are, and yeah, you know, we're just gonna wait it out. We're just gonna look at this shoe until, uh, yeah, hopefully it's gonna say got him. I'm going for a woman's 12.5, uh, men's size 11. Uh, this shoe looks good. I, I think it's better than that Ben Marnier shoe, to, to be honest. Uh, I like the green outsole, and I'm happy to be going for it today. Please feel free to subscribe to this channel. Yep, we are just here, killing time. Uh, I think I might have to spend resale for this, so hopefully I'll save some money. Maybe even if I get this shoe, I'll trade it up for this because, man, this is like my dream shoe. I really want this. <laughs> That's the funny. As much as I like the one I'm going for now, this is my dream of that this would be my grail of 22 all right so yeah we are just waiting four minutes until the drawing happens um you know as i say nike updated their sneakers buying uh you know terms of service i'm not sure what the terms are you know if you're new to this channel uh, there's also this shoe uh, let me see what it's going for wolf gray and pure platinum uh let's look uh, at it on stock x Okay, so it doesn't look like there's a lot of resale with this. 206, it costs, and you could get it for $206 if you, um, but want it on, um, if you want this in resale, for resale, you could just have to spend $40 more to get it. It might be worth it. That That is a nice shoe, but I, I mean, I, I cannot justify paying $160 for just a plain dunk. For me, that's a big ripoff. I mean, just because there's $40 in resale value doesn't mean you should go for it. We're three minutes until the drawing. Hopefully, we're going to win. Uh, it's, it's a let everyone order at the same time uh, drawing. Uh, I mean, I, I don't know if I'm going to win or not. I mean, I, I hope I don't have problems with my password. You know, sometimes it makes you enter the password, and I don't like it when that happens. Um, but, yeah, we're, we're just going to wait here uh, until for two more minutes until the drawing happens. And it's a Joker themed shoe, so the demand is going to be well. It's unofficially Joker themed, but I think you can tell what they're going for, you know, with the aesthetic. It's a woman's shoe, so you have to order up one and a half sizes if you're a man. Um, it goes up to men's size 15, so be aware that the upper sizes are going to be much more difficult to get. I mean. I'm probably not going to hit. It costs two hundred dollars, and in uh, on StockX, it it shows like one hundred and fifty dollars in resale. At, so I mean, I, I'm not counting on winning today, but you never know. All right, so now we're down to the last minute. All right, so let's uh, put me. Uh, all right, so. We are down to the last minute. With this, I got my Yankee jersey on. 
and hopefully we're going to cop. All right, so let me. It's going to do facial recognition, so I'm going to take the hat off. All right, so. Yeah, we are. Remember, amends. 12.5, I got to get. M12.5. All right, one minute left. And remember to go up one and a half sizes if you're a guy. It's frozen. <laughs> That's not good. It's totally frozen. I, I can't buy it. I hope I'm not blocked from purchasing today. It's not letting me buy. All right, so I mean, I, I guess I won't be purchasing today. I, I cannot <laughs> click it. It won't let me. <laughs> All right, so this is what's happening. Uh, I, I mean, maybe it's my screen. I mean, can I click? I, I could click on anything except the 200 thing. I, I mean, am I? All right, now it's letting me in. Check out error. It's no longer available. What the hell? <laughs> Maybe they pushed it back. Yeah, sometimes they delay the pushback. Yeah, sometimes they push the sale back and they tell you five minutes. Uh, late yeah they I, I am so pissed off now oh i mean what the hell <laughs> I, I did all this for nothing i mean i don't know what the hell it's doing it says it's no longer available i mean did they take it off did they push the I mean, is this pushed back? It's, oh, it's sold out on, on All right, I'm trying to get it on the app now. Oh, I'm in line on the app, on the website. That's strange. I mean, I, I was able to get in on the website, but I, I couldn't get in on my cell phone. Uh, I, that's very weird. I mean, I'm pending. I, I, I'm just not pending on my cell phone, so I can't show the results. I'll, I'm going to take pictures of uh, my results when uh, they flash on the screen. I mean, I, I don't want to put the screen in, in the live stream because I don't want to show my info. But I'm in line. Well, let me... Okay, so Okay, so it's 
it says I'm I'm in line. I'm on the computer. I'm buying it on the computer. Uh, yeah, I, I mean, it, it's going to tell me on the computer uh, desktop app if I, I purchased it or not. I, I was able to get it there. I think that they might have uh, tried to get fewer i think they wanted fewer buyers on the app so they moved it to desktop thinking that the botters were all using cell phones but i, I was able to enter in all my information on, on the desktop so i mean it appears that they did a trick you know and i'm pending so we're, we're gonna see what the results are from my desktop, you know, I'm, I'm just going to wait out. I didn't get them. All, all right, guys. Uh, it's no big deal. All right. That, well, that was very weird. So let me explain. Uh, first, they tell me I'm in line. And then the news is on the desktop program that I didn't get them. I could not enter on my cell phone. Uh, I think that the reason why they banned me from entering on my cell phone, you know, is because they might suspect that I'm a reseller. I do purchase a lot of shoes from Nike. See, I recently got like these. I got these fours. I got these fives. So, you know, I, I and I reviewed these shoes. You could feel free to watch the reviews. Give me some watch time. But I, I was unable to get the shoes off of the desktop app, which you know didn't surprise me. Um, you know, it's, oh, you had five devices and none of them worked and, and not one worked. Wow. <laughs> yeah. 109 to 60 dollars for some dunks. Yeah. That, that's the comment, you know, all right. Yeah. You're, you're getting a highlighted, uh, uh yeah, yeah. Pin, pin the message, $196 uh, for dunks. You're fine. Yeah, yeah, you had five different devices and none of them worked. Wow. Yes, guys. Well, that that was a very strange live cop episode. Um, so from now on, like if it bans you from entering on your cell phone, get on the desktop. Uh, because what they're doing is that yeah, they, they want fewer buyers for these top level shoe drawings. So they make maybe this is true maybe it's not true they're making people go through the desktop that's just the theory i have okay guys thank you very much for tuning into this broadcast have a wonderful and safe halloween out let's go yankees <laughs>